Hey guys, let's see what Tox plays. Today, Tox plays Hearthstone and gets into a Tavern Brawl. Hey guys, Tox Show is here, ready for Tavern Brawl number 135. Uh, I've got a bunch of packs to open up after this match here. Shadow Reflection, this sounds familiar. Build a deck of any size and we'll fill the rest of the 30 cards with Shadow Reflections that copy the last card you play. Maybe we haven't had this. Um, my first thought was to make a deck of one card, and then I could just keep copying that, but that doesn't actually... One, that doesn't work because once I end my turn, the rest of the copies won't do anything. Second is it doesn't guarantee I'm going to get that first card, unless it's a quest, but that wouldn't really do me anything. Um, that's interesting. What good combos can I do? Hmm... What good combos are there uh, where I can use the same card many times? I guess anything Jade, which is, I don't know, I feel like that's sort of just, uh, I'm going to do it, even though it's like not probably the thing everyone's going to hate the most. Uh, okay. Um, and then things that make copies. Such as um, Zola the Gorgon. Um, um, I guess Barnes with Aya would be nice, but not with anything else. Um, Yeah, I feel like there's something else I'm thinking of. I guess I've been playing Rogue Jade Rogue more, which has Death Rattles. Um, maybe that would be a better deck. I don't know. Um, and then some return cards. Yikes. There we go. 12 cards, all jade. Uh, I feel like I'm missing some things that would make this better. Um, oh, this is wild. I can put Bran in, can't I? I can. Um, I don't know that it's worth it to have Death Rattles go off twice. Um, but I am going to put in Emperor uh, Thoros in. I don't know that ramp really makes that much sense. Although double ramping, I guess, could be good. I'm just going to leave it at this. See how it goes. Uh, I feel kind of guilty for doing a Jade deck, but... It's the first thing that comes to mind that just gets better with doubling. Uh, I'm sure there's a bunch of other good combos. That was just the first thing that came to mind. Okay. Uh, don't want these shadow reflections yet. There's plenty in my deck, so I'm likely to draw more anyway. Uh, Zola is not useful unless I get something else, so. That's not the something else I wanted. Hmm. <laughs> I get Zola anyway. Okay. Maybe zooing with a bunch of one costs would actually be best. I'm just going to hero power. I guess I'll just play this on curve. Not on curve, actually, but 
uh, yeah. And this is too expensive to play and then play a copy of. Maybe this was not a great idea. Okay, yep, I'll just play that. I don't have enough money to play that. Maybe ramp actually would have been good then. Um, obviously getting uh, Jade Idols would be great, because I can just play like four in a row. As soon as I draw a Jade Idol, I'm going to be feeling pretty good. Wow, okay. I'm not playing Zola on nothing. I think I'll play Jade Behemoth first, because he seems to be at least a little bit more zooey. Oh, that's fine. Maybe I should actually, what I should probably do is put in a bunch of cheap draw, and then Jade Idol. That would actually probably be pretty effective. Because as soon as I get Jade Idol, I'll be able to do a ton. Okay. I'm going to Jade Idol this because then I can... Oop. I can Zola twice. Okay, they can trade with those. That's gonna just kill my dude behemoth, but I can play another one. Actually, I might trade. Now I'll let him attack and then I'll trade next time, because these guys hopefully will still be up. I guess he might trade with them, but I will also have a jade out. I can do that, that, and this. This will cause it to die when it attacks. Oh, why don't I have Fandral in here? Oh, that's actually... Pretty good. But you can't kill that with these guys, which means I'll still be able to trade. He's gonna get some damage in, but actually, yeah, this might not be. Ooh, no, well, that doesn't trigger, okay. Yeah, I'm on a timer now with his weapon. I guess there's no reason not to play that. Come on, Jade Idol. He can break this and have one more damage go through. Uh, I'm guessing he's gonna kill Bran, but he might just go face. Does he have lethal? No. He does, he is exact lethal. Okay. I'm gonna try this again. It's the best way of getting my Jade out real quickly. I think it's just gonna be with a bunch of draw. I'm gonna put Fangel in there too. And maybe the the Jade uh, ramp too. Okay, here's here's what I'm gonna do. Uh don't need youthful. Uh, I'm not gonna put Bran in. No reason for Zola, because I'm not going to have 
those. Yeah. Okay. Um. Draw. Oh, innervate's interesting. If you have a bunch of the shadows and you innervate, 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 you can like multiple innervate a bunch for a one turn quick ramp. Sort of. Um. Uh, what was I looking for? Draw, draw, right, okay. Um, that's some draw, that's some draw. Draw. Why didn't I put my gold ones in? Uh, I feel like this is getting more expensive on the draw side. <laughs> Multiple darknesses, that's interesting. Um... Wrath for removal and draw. This gets us both draw or both ramp. Yeah, I'm going to stop here actually. Branching paths might be good. I forgot I only have one of those. Let's see how this goes. Everything's much cheaper, which means I can actually play doubles of them more easily. First time I get Jade Idol, I'm going to. If I, depending on how many, yeah, depending on when I get Jade Idol and how many I have, how many Shadow Reflections I have in my hand, I'll probably want to make a couple of them um, to shuffle more of my deck. I actually really like the ramp. It's a, I'm going to shuffle three of these back in because it's more likely than not that I'll end up actually getting them back. If I don't, I'm going to be drawing them a lot. Actually, I'm fine with this. I might, my, uh, might, I might... Ooh. I'm going to say I might make my first Jade Idol shuffle more in, but I might want to play this on turn two to put two out. Yeah. I'll play one, shuffle one. I'm actually really surprised I only ended up with uh, one Shadow Reflection in my hand. Okay. So I will play one, I will shuffle one. And next turn I'll ramp, and then maybe if maybe I'll double ramp on turn five when I have six mana. Because this will bring me to five. I'll be at three, I'll be at five, and then I'll be at six. Yeah. And this is uh, useful in that it gives me draw, but it can also give me armor. I'm probably not going to end up using the attack very often. Okay. Okay. Okay, he's going to trade there. Unfortunately, I don't have any AoE. But I can kill one of them. Actually, I could kill two if I use my Shadow Reflection, which isn't really what I want to use it for, but I also want to stay alive. Let's hope I draw a Shadow Reflection and can Jade Blossom twice.
I just realized uh, Rogue might actually just want to... You might want to just play Rogue and use these Shadow Reflections to get multiple of the same card out to get the quest done really quickly. And then have just spam a bunch of uh, cheap minions, maybe withdraw, to get a ton of 5-5s five out. Um, I don't have Shadow Reflections right now, so I want to wait on that. I guess... Actually, let's. I can draw a card. Actually, I can draw multiple cards and then maybe play j multiple Jade Idols. Okay. I am going to gain six armor and then play that to get more cards next turn. I don't want to. Yeah. Um, I need the armor now, I think. I will play... I guess I'll hero power into that. In turn. Okay, hopefully when I Cold Light Oracle, I'll find a couple Shadow Reflections, maybe I'll draw a Shadow Reflection, and then I can start Jade Isling a bunch. I was hoping to get my loot hoarder out too to get an extra draw, but I wanted to make sure I got rid of that uh, um, Yeti. What to do? What to do? They don't have removal, so I mean, my removal is big jades basically. Um, so if I don't get those out quickly, those <laughs> Boulder Fist Ogres, now plural, uh, will be a problem. I'm assuming he's going to trade that way, but yeah, I maybe just <laughs> told him to do that, but um, yeah, actually I'm getting pretty close to dead here, this might be an issue. Try two more cards, I'm probably giving him some burn, possibly. Okay. Summon 5-5, five, five. summon 6-6. Six, six. Summon seven seven. Oh shoot, I did that in the wrong order. I should have drawn before I started doing that. Uh, shuffle more in. Draw a card. Yeah, I could have played one more Jade Idol if I had drawn first. Regardless, if he is burn, he kills me this turn, because I will be down to three health. Okay. I guess I live. He might want to trade, though, in case I live even more. Looks like that's what he's thinking about. It sucks that I have to trade a five. Hmm. Great, another shadow reflection. That does me nothing. It's actually really bad. I'm gonna play all of them just because um, I need I need stuff so that I can trade whatever he puts out, otherwise I'm dead. Because I have no instant removal. I was going to put Naturalize in and I decided not to, and now I'm not sure why, because as a Jade Idol deck I could Fatigue as well. Um, that's interesting, maybe I should make a Jade Mill deck. Uh, J well, Jade Mill deck, but I'm in a Druid Mill deck. He does have Burn. Did he just draw that? Did he top deck that? Because he could have done that last turn. Okay, um, it's been 20 minutes. I think I'm going to try one more. Maybe I should try a rogue mill. No. The thing is, though, I don't have Jade Idol to help me out. Um, I don't know if branching paths was worth it. I'm going to take that out. Healing, I think, might be worth it. 
Uh, especially if I can play that twice. Let me look up Restore. Oops. Uh, anti heal bot I think is too expensive. Um. Hmm. Having this to play twice is kind of nice. Although, Gadgets and Socialite might be better because it's cheaper. I don't know. I don't want to. I don't want to put too many new things in my deck. I feel like it wasn't bad. I wish. Yeah, I could put one of these in for more draw. Acolyte of Pain. I don't. Uh, it might be useful. Oh right, removal. Okay. I might take Wrath out actually and just use uh, Naturalize. The thing is, I I keep feeling like oh, it means I have. When I can make copies, I have infinite. But no, I, you know, if I play both, then they're gone. Um, so I, yeah, I'll leave it at this. Yeah, Let's try it one more time. Might be diluting my deck a bit too much because um, the more cards I put in, the fewer uh, shadow reflections I get. But. Playing this, I feel like this is the first time we've had it, but for some reason, I feel like the picture at the beginning seemed familiar, like we've done this before, so I don't know. I actually kind of like this. I have to coin before I jade that. I'll have to remember that. Maybe... I don't get a coin. Interesting. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to ramp. To five, and then I'm gonna play one, two, three, four, five jade idols in one turn. Then maybe, well, we'll see. Okay, and then I'll have an extra one to double jade blossom the turn after that. So ramp this turn. Next turn is gonna be one, two, three, four, five jade idols, and then the turn after that is gonna be two jade blossoms. This is the ideal hand. What's he doing now? Shadow visioning forever? What? Oh, he's making copies of the... Oh! Oh my gosh. Wow. That's interesting. Does he have inner fire? If he has inner fire, I'm screwed. Actually, I still live. I still live. Um, I have enough to destroy that, so he'll get damage off on me, but my stuff sticks around. Every jade I make after this will still be bigger, while his big guy will be gone. He's deciding to get his damage in. Six... Five and one, three here. Okay, I'm at ten health, but I have very wonderful board control here. Not board, yeah, board control. Right? Isn't that when you have the board? It's called board control. Or am I thinking of have control of the board? Uh, same thing. Okay. Okay. 
Oh my gosh, one off lethal. Okay. I suppose you could have Mind Blast, Shadow Reflection, or Shadow Reflection. That would kill me. Mm, but he doesn't. Alright, now to open a ton of packs. Um, so I have a pack, I think, from this week and last week, because last week I believe I got it after um, after the video. I guess I have three. I don't know why I have three. Um, and then there were they gave out three packs because there are issues with the quests not appearing recently. And then I logged in today and got two more, and I'm not sure why I got those extra two. So let's just start opening and see what I get, because I don't care where they came from. Okay, double light warden. Interesting. Ooh, come on. Mind control tech and knife juggler. All right. Let's get to the kobolds packs. An epic. That's nice. Astral tiger. I either had zero or only one of those. I think I had zero of those, so I'm happy with that. I've been wanting to make an astral tiger deck. I didn't think it was worth uh, crafting. Okay. Master Pearl Bellstone. Gravel Snow Knight. Last pack. Is it legendary? Do we have a legendary? We have an epic. That's nice. Reckless Flurry. Pretty sure I don't have it. I pretty sure I don't have two of those. Um, not sure. Maybe didn't even have one. Let's disenchant. Get some dist. Exactly twelve hundred. Okay, and then extra. I guess I should have said new, but extra is fine. Uh, no extras, and then Astral Tiger, first one, new. Spellstone didn't have two of those, and that's my first Reckless Flurry. All right. Okay, well, uh, I thought the Temporal was interesting. I'm sure you can make much more interesting decks than the one I had. Um, having, um, what the priest I just played, um, what the heck is the name of that spell? Discover a, discover a spell in your deck. Um, it's interesting because I would have thought... That the shadow reflections, uh, shadow visions, shadow reflections count as spells, but I guess they don't. So you can play this um, to f pick out particular spells in your deck, which is nice. Uh, that's great for mind blast. That's great for a lot of things. But uh, divine shield, uh, uh, sorry, divine spirit, inner fire is a great combo. Um, and of course, as long as you have one radiant elemental, shadow reflection can make the other one, making the shadow visions free. Um, he seemed to get that combo super quickly. I don't think that's typical. We both had really good hands uh, that game, I guess. But uh, yeah, doing a priest deck like that seems pretty good. Um, Power Word Shield might be useful there too with the Divine Shield because um, I mean, not Divine Shield, Divine Spirit. Um, you'll be drawing cards, maybe more reflections to make more shields, draw more cards. Uh, I don't know. That seemed like a good good deck though, but I don't know how often like he, he got it off really early and uh if I didn't have the hand that I did, I, there's no way I would have won that. So um but that priest deck might be something to try. And I think um I'm probably gonna try a rogue deck with uh I don't even know if I want Shadow Step. I think I want Shadow Step. Um and the quest. Where's the rogue quest? Uh, Caverns Blow, because um, this can be really, really easy to play five minions when you can just make tons of copies of it, um, and you put lots of draw, uh, so let's say, um, I mean, Loot Horrors, Novice Engineers, Cold Light Oracles, and um, Elven Minstrel would be good too, just to pull minions out of your deck. And then leave the rest as shadow um, reflections. 
Oh, no, then you want to, I guess, see, there's an issue, is you want to fill your deck with cards that will be um, cheap minions. Um, what am I doing? Oh, it's still on draw. Um, I guess patches would be good. Um, anything that creates multiple minions, of course. Uh, Stone Tusk Boar is going to be good. But then, as soon as you start filling your deck up too much, you're going to have fewer shadow reflections, which makes doing the quest harder. Um, and Dragonhawk, I guess, is good as a 5-5, five five, isn't it? Um, that's great. Yeah, that's good. And suddenly I'm like, I have almost no shadow reflections. Uh, where's the... Where am I, am I missing... Here we go. Mock Hide Hunter. Um, so, maybe not patches, because I don't think I have any other pirates. You could put pirates in here, but again, then you're... Like, I would probably take out of a minstrel at that point. Um, I'd probably take patches out just because... I mean, it's a charge, but we've got a couple other charges, and I want Shadow Reflections to do the quest. So, I don't know. Um... Maybe take out Young Dragonhawk. But but you at the same time you want lots of minions because otherwise your quest does nothing, so I don't know. Um but probably try something like that. Um Anyway, I thought it was interesting. I feel like like I mentioned earlier, I feel like this is a new brawl. Um but I will go and look and link to it previously if we have done it before. Um Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, um, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you, as always, for watching. Talks out. Hi, guys. Thanks for watching this week's Tavern Brawl. If you want to check out my Tavern Brawl playlist, you can do so up above. If you want to check out the previous brawl, you can do so on the left, and I'd love it if you subscribed. As always, feel free to like, dislike, and or comment, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you, as always, for watching. Talks out.